Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Selena and this is Occupied by Fashion. So today I have a super exciting video. It's something I've been wanting a long time. So today I'm going to be reviewing and unboxing the Toiletry 15 from Louis Vuitton. So without further ado, here we go. So it just came in the mail. Here it is. So I'm just going to unbox it. Actually, let me show you. So it comes like is it backwards <laughs> yeah it is because i'm there we go he comes like this and then you open it up oh and then here is the box and then they also have the receipt i actually really like how their boxes have their name on i think it's a super simple but classy touch so here's the receipt um it just has like Louis Vuitton exchanges and returns. It says thank you for shopping. Uh, and then it has like the return label. And it actually has the actual receipt. Yep, the gift receipt. So I did order this online from Louis Vuitton website. I haven't stalked this website because there are four things I have to have. So I have to have the Louis Vuitton toiletry 15, 19, 26, and I have to have the Preset Accessoire. So if you see these videos coming, just know they're on the way. I will be giving them by any means necessary. <laughs> I really want them. So here is the toiletry 15. So it didn't come with a bow, but I'm not mad. Um, I don't ever, my, it's not that big of a deal to me. Um, Here's the box. So here is the toiletry 15. So I do have the Pichette Mini, but it doesn't have wipeable lining. And I do feel like this one could probably fit a little bit more. And I want to use it as a cosmetic pouch. So, cause wipeable, the wipeable lining inside. So here it is. And here is the little number of how to find it and telling you what it is. So, I mean, I will tell you what this uh, measurements are for this one. Give me one second. I have them right here. So, it is 5.3 inches across. The diameter is 1.6 and the height is 3.9. Yes. Pretty sure. So, and like I said, this is my first monogram piece of Louis Vuitton. All my other things are Gemi or Eben, and I just happen to really like that one, and I prefer that one. But this, I only saw that it came in monogram. I might be wrong if I am. Let me know. I will happily go purchase those ones. That is my favorite one. But couldn't find it, and I really wanted to protect it inside of my bag, so I had to settle on this one. But I'm not mad. I actually do really love this, too. Um, I do want to get luggage pieces eventually so I'm, I'll just stick to the monogram for those um mine is made in Spain I'm not mad about that I'm not really particular on where it's made at. I know some people are I'm not I'm just like I got the thing if the quality is good that's all that matters to me and the quality of this one seems to be very very good I don't see any mistakes I mean there is like this but I mean I don't know that seems fine to me the the lining is perfectly stitched sewn given um the the little zipper pool looks nice flawless um it zips it zips really easy it unzips just as easy i actually like that um so yeah here's the inside so i mean some things I would put in here typically is the bag I'm carrying right now. So I'm just going to see like what show you what I would put in here really quick. So I put my oil absorbent sheets. I have way too many receipts in here. We're just gonna put that on the floor. Um, I don't have my lashes in right now, but I will be getting them done soon. So I would stick this in here. I would also put pretty much anything that can spill my bag and make me cry, I will be putting in 
this. So I have, if y'all know about sunscreen from Image, I'm gonna put you onto it. This happens to be one of the best sunscreens I've ever had, ever tried. Um, I sometimes forget, so I keep a small one in here. Um, my eyes do get dry because I tend to, I'm just a really emotional person and like if my feelings get hurt, I'm bound to cry. So, yes. Um, sometimes I say, why did I choose civil engineering? It is sometimes, it's really rewarding, but frustrating nonetheless. And then I'd also just put some Carmex in my perfume. So these two things. And then I think that's, oh, in my lotion. That's literally all I would put in here. Um, and I didn't put them in any particular way. I just stuffed them in here. And it fits really good. All these things fit really good. And there's still a lot more room. So I actually seem to prefer this over my pochette mini. As far as I can see, I actually really, really like this. I'll just put some a leave in here just because. Let's zip this up. Perfect. I'm... I already can tell I'm in love with this. Um, I'm really, really happy with this. I like it. So yeah, just to show you, again, it fits a pretty good size amount. It's for small things, but um, I just have it like this. Again, I have a little Advil pill. I have a little, um, maybe a lotion. I have some Carmex. I have a perfume. Like, what's well, not? You put your perfume on here, but I have that. I have some eye drops. I have some blotting sheets. And I have some sunscreen and an eyelash wand. This fits a pretty good size amount. If you are on the fence about this size and if it's worth it, I think it seems to be well worth it. I haven't actually used it yet, but it seems to be well worth it. In my opinion, I do have the Pochette Mini and I can tell I prefer this one. So, hey, without further ado, this is the video. Um, thank you for watching and have a great day. Please subscribe if you like the content, by the way. Thank you. Have a good one.